Hey, welcome back, everybody. My next guest tonight, my friends, is an actress you know from Baywatch and Home Improvement. She's just written a new cookbook called I Love You, Recipes from the Heart. Please welcome to The Late Show, Pamela Anderson. One day. We're happy to have you on. It's um, nice to be here. Welcome back to New York. I know you live out on Vancouver Island now, I right? I do. I do. It's a lovely place. I love it. Yeah, my yeah. little vegetable farm, and that's kind of what inspired the book. So New York's a little different. Do you like it here? I love it here. I'm not afraid of it anymore. Well, were you once? I was once afraid of New York. I was what, afraid of what, New York. what made you? Well, once of I once well I did I did um, played Roxy in Chicago on Broadway. Oh sure. And I was here for a couple months. Yeah. And I fell in love with Central Park. Yeah. And I even adopted a tree there. Is that what this is? Yes. They gave me a photo before oh, you yes. came on. Oh, yes. Well, this is my What's tree. happening here? This is your, you planted, how big was this tree? Well, when no, I, I adopted it. It's, it's. Oh, you didn't plant this I tree. I didn't plant this it. It's self-planted and it's yes. actually uh, called the tree of heaven. And I, I gave it to my boys in honor of my boys, a little plaque. And I said, dreams do come true. Oh, that's lovely. I like it. Seems like it's got a interesting root system there. Well, it's growing out of a rock, kind of like, you know, wow. rock, roses from pavement. Kind of a, kind of a, kind of a miracle like that. <laughs> Um, you, you and I have something in common, is that we've both, we've both written uh, cookbooks. Your, your new one is called, I Love You, Recipes yes. from the Heart. What made you want to write this? Well, I gave my sons a recipe box for their housewarming gift, and I engraved the box, I Love You. And then, of course, being the business people that my sons are, I said, Mom, this is a cookbook. We're going to a publisher. Wow. And I said, okay, I just do whatever I'm told these days. <laughs> Are you yeah. a big baker? I'm a big baker. I love sourdough. I know you have a sourdough starter. I have a, I, someone sent me a 150 year old sourdough starter. Well, I started my own sourdough starter like three years ago and her name is Astrid. And she's waiting for me in the fridge back in sorry. Canada. I'm sorry, and she's Go very back. hungry. Go back. <laughs> Your sourdough's name is Astrid? Yes, Viking warrior princess. We is that what you are? Is that who you are? Yeah. yeah. Is that, so, so, what? Well, tell me, tell me about Astrid. What's she like? She's bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> she's strong. Uh huh. She works hard. Uh huh. Yeah. She, uh -huh. She's made a lot of bread. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are like? What are your, what's your go-to? What's a, what's your favorite thing to make other than well, the sourdough? What do you what do you do? Well, I'm a good. I love soups. My kids always expect soup when they come. But I'm a big pierogi maker. I'm a big dill pickle maker. I'm a big canner and pickling and all that mm. stuff. That's kind of a family mm. thing. But I'll sing you some pickles. Sure. Yeah. I would love some pickles. Are you uh, pickles a big Scandinavian thing? That's a big Anderson, Canadian thing Anderson, too. Anderson, are you uh, Danish, Swedish? No, my, well, my I, my dad's Finnish. Finnish. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. What's the Finnish food? What's the cuisine of Finland? Well, I have, well, I've made a Finnish bread. There's a Finnish seeded bread that's in there. Mm -hmm. And um, that's all I know. <laughs> well, I've, I've, there's something back here that, this, that, that they asked me. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Yes. Okay. No, you don't have to do, you don't have to be sorry. This is my visiting I'm cake. I'm sorry. What is, what is, is it called a Scandinavian visiting it's cake? A Scandinavian visiting cake, yes. And so but... you bring this. When you're visiting or when someone visits you, you bring out the Scandinavian. It looks a little Am different I... than mine, but it's still really good. Mm -hmm. I'm sure it's I'm very sure it's good. Not as good. Wait, before no, we do good. this, yeah. I also oh, we understand have some... you also have your own blend of teas that you like. Yes, I make my own teas. Uh huh. And this, I've been told, has been brewed in your honor for being here. It's, it's what you call your sensual blend. It is a sensual blend. Be careful. How? how... <laughs> How, how sensual is this going to get, Pam Anderson? <laughs> we'll soon find out. Okay. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, this looks really good, actually, because you know it is kind of cold in here. That's why I wore my That's scarf. That's how I keep it. Comedy mm -hmm. weather. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. How good is that? Mm. It's nice. It's fantastic. Did, nice. You, did you learn, I understand you learned some of this from your grandmother? Um, no. Okay. No. <laughs> oh, Scratch that out no, right no, there. Hold on. Cook. <laughs> no, I really learned how to cook on my own because, you know, in doing this book, I thought I should go look in some of my grandmother's um, cookbooks. You know, a lot of her handwriting is there. And I looked, there was not one recipe that didn't have meat in it. 
Oh, you know, that's so my of, misunderstanding. You, I knew you went to your grandmother's. I forgot you were vegan. Oh, yeah. Well, yes. We, we should have led with that. Well, no, it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm trying to downplay the vegan thing. I just want it to be about you celebrating about vegetables. It. Vegans it's, are accepted. They're allowed to, no, like, no, no, but I mean, like go to law school so, and everything now. No, I don't want it to be just shoved down the shelf anywhere. I think just, this is it's such just plant-based. It's not it's vegan. It's just plant-based. It's plant-based. Let nobody freak out. I was no. vegan for seven months. Well, I'm vegan is good. I'm vegan, is, vegan is good, but sometimes vegan scares people. You know, so. How long have you been the plant-based? For compassionate reasons, I started eating plant-based, and then just, you know, over a lifetime, I've realized. Meh. It's a good thing. Health-wise, mm -hmm. my for wife, the planet, uh, you know. My wife Evie has never enjoyed meat. No. She's never enjoyed meat except when she was massively pregnant with our first child. We well, have to listen to your body, and I don't, yeah. you know, judge anyone who eats any different way. I just kind of want to supplement or, or complement or, you know, be a part of the food journey. Because since I, I've always cooked, and people don't really know that side of me, but I am a big nurturer, and but, my boys, you know. This Made is fantastic. Me do this. Tell me about this welcoming cake. I feel very welcome. Do you feel welcome? But well, you know what's so nice? It's a little cake that you can put together when people come over to visit. You know, you want to mm. play cards. I'm getting old. Almond. <laughs> Almond paste. Mm -hmm. A little bit of mm -hmm. frangipane in there or mm -hmm. something like that. It's mm -hmm. very nice. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Is it true that your, is it your tree, is it true that your meat-loving grandmother <laughs> used to host ba biker gangs? Yes. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. No, but she had a she had a little tea house. My grandfather passed away, and I think she just really enjoyed <laughs> the company of men. <laughs> she enjoyed the company of men. Big burly men. Big burly men. And she's and like, I can just see them like. Exactly. <laughs> so these bikers would come in and have tea at your grandmother's place. Yes. She seems fun. <laughs> She would say, come on in, I got plenty of meat. <laughs> wow. Oh my wow. God. No, wow. but she, just, she had an auto court and she, she just felt safer with the bikers. <laughs> yeah, so, well, they get a bad rap, I think. Do they? Bikers? Oh, see, yeah, that's what I They're all pussy cats. <laughs> oh yeah. Why, have you encountered some bad bikers? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Good and bad, good and bad, you know. Good and so bad. It's okay. It's you gotta everybody. take the good and no the bad with be, the motorcycle yeah, gangs. No one, yeah, no one wants to be defined by their worst days or their worst no, habits. No, no, no. no. I'm just gonna sit so here and eat Bates some cake. Kathy Bates is amazing. Isn't what a Kathy wonderful, Bates wonderful, she's sweet so person. lovely. Yeah. So lovely. And you're That's, funny. Oh. <laughs> I just feel like we're at home. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Her cookbook, I Love You, is available tomorrow. Pamela Anderson, everybody. We'll be right back.